here we are, August 24th. It'll be a day long remembered in Perfect House history. We started off the day with some locked up breaks. We then moved on to uh, a scorchingly hot, devastatingly hot day of moving and doing errands in the rooster. And we ended the day with using the rooster to tow the, t the perfect house mobile uh, a couple blocks up Cahuenga Boulevard because the transmission blew it. Anyway, I'm sitting here in the remnants of my bedroom, which isn't my bedroom, isn't so much my bedroom anymore, but it's the only one I got. Not much of a bedroom. But I still got my Serenity poster, I still got my Rush poster. I haven't given them to John just yet, but eh. still got my stuff in it. It's cool. Ready to hit the road, though. I guess we're sticking around here for another day or two because who knows how long the transmission is going to take to rebuild or do whatever to tomorrow. I think it's just seals. I think the seals went dry. I hope, I don't, I don't hope. I'm pretty sure the transmission's okay. Just needs new seals, but that's kind of a lengthy procedure. Might take a while. So, we were supposed to leave tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. Then we decided we needed to wait until the mail came, which is 1 or 2 p.m. Because Chris and Andrea canceled their debit card and had to get a new one, and it's in the mail. And all kinds of things have happened tonight that have just been incredible. Christina walked in and dropped a bomb on us, and she might have been the angel, angel of the evening and saved all of our collective bacon. We'll see, we'll see. Um, it's been a hard, tiring, but interesting day. I, uh, I was stoned and I helped two cops push a car across the street today. That was kind of funny. Uh, but I guess some of that good karma, even though a lot of bad karma, kind of, well, not bad karma, but bad luck fell on us. It was better here happening right here close to the mechanic then halfway to the Grand Canyon which is where we would have been tomorrow had we tried to drive the thing without uh, testing it out first which our mechanic recommended that we do and we drove it into Hollywood and gave uh, Mike Garrow our TV and forced him to give us $350 the trip back from Hollywood was where the problems began the transmission started slipping but we ended you know, we got it to a stop and uh, couldn't go any further and started inspecting it and, and two smoking hot girls peeked their head over the, uh, the fence of the apartment that we stopped right in front of and they're like, hey boys, need anything? Cold beer, smoke, whatever you want, <laughs> anything. And it was pretty cool. <laughs> and uh, we got it a little further and then it died and did a lot of pushing and swearing and getting sweared at for blocking the on-ramp to the 101 and half of Kohenga Boulevard. But hey, you do what you gotta do. And we went and got the rooster and towed it up the street. And uh, first thing in the morning, we'll be taking it to the mechanic again and saying, uh, what's up? What do we gotta do to get this right so we can get on the road? Austin, hope to see you on Monday. Ox, stand by. Good night.